It's described as the most exciting classroom in the world. Pupils here get to watch pop stars perform. For those of you who are expecting Harry Styles, I apologize. Listen to royalty speak and hear from some of the most influential people on the planet. It's called We Day, and this morning 12,000 school children got to experience it at Wembley Arena. This is the first We Day to be held outside North America, and it's all about empowering young people. As you can see, it's a very popular event. But you can't buy a ticket to We Day, and every single person here has earned theirs by doing something to help their local community. These students from St Peter's London Docks Primary in Tower Hamlets were rewarded with tickets because of their fundraising efforts for communities in Ecuador. They even got a royal shout-out. from St Peter's London Docks Primary School. It's been really cool and I feel really like proud to be part of this project. It's a really once in a lifetime um, event that I could go see, but I, if, there, if I could see more I would. From London dance group Diversity to former US Vice President Al Gore, there was no shortage of inspiration in the room. But there was one guest who certainly left an impression on everyone. We should love each other, we should accept each other's views, and we should respect it. 16-year-old education activist Malala Yousafzai, who was shot in the head by the Taliban a year and a half ago. At 16 years old, to be able to go out and speak so eloquently about it and try to rally the world around women's rights. Um, what an inspiration. The organisers hope this can be an annual event in the capital. And for the pupils, well, as far as school days go, it doesn't get much better. Amelia Papadopoulos, BBC London News.